Frankie, thank you for joining. How are you today? If you are still here, let me know how is the sound, please. Okay, thank you. I will start in a while. Just some minutes to wait for more people. Hi Anupa, thank you for joining. Yeah, it's been a while since my last live stream. I was a little bit sick and wasn't able to do any live stream, so today let's just paint this rabbit and let's see how it's gonna turn out. It's a little bit challenging painting for me as well. How many subscribers you have? I have over 1000 subscribers right now. But I still need watch hours. So this is why I'm doing these live streams. How are you? I'm fine right now. I'm okay. Thank you for asking. I guess it's gonna be long live stream because it's animal and usually it takes long especially with those details on this rabbit as you can see from this reference photo so let's just prepare our paints that I will be mixing I don't have green, so I'm using blue and yellow to make it. So this is black, this is uh, Prussian blue, this is cobalt blue and this is cadmium yellow. And also I will add some raw sienna and uh, burnt umber to make four but we don't need so much right now but anyway i will add so you can see it's kind of similar than just brown probably just different tone of brown Yeah, Anki, time started already. It takes time to prepare all this, so no need rush. Okay, so let's just mix some dark green for our background hi Nidle, thank you for joining finally I'm doing live stream 
it's been a while since last time. Okay, let's mod add more Prussian blue and a little bit yellow because it's kind of too dark. I will just mix some different tones of this green. So let's use cobalt blue, cadmium yellow to get another tone of our green. It's gonna be lighter. Actually, to be honest, those color mixing takes so much time but it's fun also because you can find different colors as well just mixing sometimes it's just surprisingly how much tones we can get and even more lighter I will use more yellow That one is, yeah, it's kind of cute, but I hope it's gonna turn out also that cute. <laughs> it's my first time to paint bunny or rabbit or how people call them. I'm using oil thinner. It will help me to blend. Bye bye, and kid. Take care. Just drop some dark spots. I think there is kind of bushes, and this is our ground where ribbon rabbit kind of standing. And I think there is like more kind of trees or leaves or foliage or something like this. So. Anyway, it's all blurred, so no need to be focused too much there. So actually we can just drop those colors randomly. Some dark spots and some light spots. I just drop some lighter and a little bit yellow also. Anyway, I'm gonna blend it after.
So I just want to divide our foliage and bushes from our ground and I will use a little bit different tone, more lighter. And for sure I will use another brush because this brush is too large. I don't want to spoil main details of our rabbit. It might be complicated to fix after. Why I don't like those first layers on the painting? Because it looks like just spots of paint and it's not understandable what, what, how it's gonna look like and it looks actually a little bit weird and people might think like what are you doing <laughs> but in fact this is just a process and it's always like this Here will be more grass, so I will not focus too much over here. I definitely need more yellow. just beside our rabbit so I'm just using this smaller brush it's gonna help me for sure in a more darker spot just beside the ears it's gonna be going down Here actually a little bit darker. Let's just add more. Even can drop some yellow also to make it a little bit lighter. I just noticed that I forgot to put white on my palette. The one of the most important tones. But okay, I will put it later. Hi Vanessa, thank you for joining. I'm painting red today and we can drop actually this shadows already just beside our rabbit because I think light going from the left side from the top 
and here definitely gonna be shadow so I can even put it right now just a little bit darker especially here on this area how are you today guys girls how is your Sunday going on Oh no, too much, too much. Should not put here. Let's just use all yellow. And again this dark green and put it here. Doing great. That's great. Okay, let's just blend the background. I'm using same blender brush as before and oil thinner as well, which is gonna help me to blend. I think I need more. Yeah, I'm kind of better right now, thank you. At least I can handle the stream, I believe. Because before, you know, when your voice changed <laughs> to do the live stream, kind of not better idea. Just started by thinking, but I like this blur background, you know, kind of cool. No need to focus too much on it and when the camera captures it, it's and it's blurred already, so not necessary to be focused too much on it. Because, anyway, main object here is our rabbit, so. You can just drop this some lighter tones just to show some deepness and some highlight moments on the background like idea of those bushes or whatever there is. So I will use more green over here. Yeah, but sometimes there is mistakes when if you want to show distance. But okay, it's a little bit different topic. It's not that topic. It's mostly on landscapes. There is like mistakes, I would say, from some artist. And I also did those mistakes. I think anybody did these mistakes when you don't use enough white on distant objects and they looked kind of close, but in fact they should be far away. But it's okay, as I said, this is a little bit another topic to discuss. It's not here. Yeah, just a little happy accident that might give a some huge mistakes. <laughs> Hi Rasnik, thank you for joining. I joined your premiere actually where you were painting fishes but I didn't notice you there I think you was absent. Hi Yet, thank you for joining as well. We actually just started some minutes ago. You didn't miss anything.
there is some problems that my neighbors here doing repair and sometimes they are loud and I hope they gonna be quiet at least when I'm doing stream because <laughs> it's too noisy okay let's just drop some yellow here and let's blend our ground just using more more yellow I will, I will add And also let's plant a little bit over here. But as you don't have a premiere, I thought there's like premiere on your channel. Or maybe it's later. Or maybe next day. Sometimes I'm lost in days can I just leave it like this mm, I think there is too much light what if I do it like this too much light I have here mm -hmm. okay let's just leave it Okay, 54 minutes, okay. I think I will still be gonna be painting the time. paint going down okay let's just do some tones of our rabbit so I'm using raw sienna and burnt tumber So those can be used for our shadow area of our rabbit. And I need white. I think I will add just a little bit white because it's too dark. Even this is shadow, it's still dark. Sienna and white. I think there is mostly color gonna be like this. Something similar, just add more sienna. Sometimes it's hard to do same, same color 
only similar but I think it's gonna be okay let's just drop it here I will just do some tones, different tones. Even more white. Because he looks like light light brown I think it's something like this especially this area also here some face can I just start with our darker tone. Hi Arthur by Shirley. Hi comics also. Thank you for joining guys. Okay, let's just do some shadows under our face. And just drop those main lines. Anyway, this area is like more darker than this one. So for underpainting, you can use this color. Then just simply do another layer, but it's gonna be after. So for now, let's just drop some basic lines in darker spots so to have over here like I think it's kind of black just darker spot at all so I think I will add just black after especially here also it's like kind of very dark so probably it's can I just do this with this burnt umber, just original color, it's gonna help me to understand that here's this shadow area. I 
little bit lighter color and I will draw it here on his neck but anyway it's gonna be covered with grass so I don't wanna be focused too much on this legs over here And I think I covered a little bit of his body over here with the background. But that's okay. It's fixable also. spot I think I can do some a little bit highlights on this area and also on this side some darker tones just a moment guys This area is a little bit lighter. Here is like a lot of light. But okay, let's just use this lighter raw sienna color that I mixed. And drop it here. And on this side I will add a little bit white. Because I think this is not a light, this is just his fur. And this is the complicated thing in animals because it has different fur and sometimes you think that this is light but actually this is not light. This is just fur which is lighter than another part of his body and it can make some misunderstanding when you are doing this animal painting. Because definitely light is here from the left side from the top and we can understand this from our shadow area which is here but what I'm doing now I'm making this side more lighter than this one only because he has that fur And here is his butt uh, just beside. I will use, make it a little bit darker to divide our first leg of his body. And more white. Okay, I just drop more burnt umber on this area and I'm gonna blend it after all 
just to make it smooth so I'm not focusing too much on details as I should because anyway this is kind of only first layer right I just blend it a little I need a little thinner and my blender blush is a little bit green I hope our rabbit not gonna be green as well Comics Brief Master, how are you today? How is your Sunday going on? Yeah, now it looks more softer. Anyway, you have to add four after all. But I wanna focus a little bit on his body shape. And also I need to add more white on this area. Because I wanna divide his leg more. So we just blend it again. Actually I can just use white with blender brush and just blend it here. little bit on the side in this area also Right. So it would be logic if light would be come from here. It will be more understandable, I could say. But nothing to do with this. If his foot is like this, I'm gonna paint like this. And I will add some shadows just behind his head. Because definitely this is the shadow area. And I can blend it also. And let's just draw up this lighter color over here. think here is a little bit darker and that's part of his leg Okay, 
let me just drop some white on the edges it's gonna show us a little bit light Actually, here is also light, light just beside shadow. Okay, so. And I will use more yellow, more white. I wanna, I wanna divide his black from the body, same as here, but it's hard seeing. Because I didn't put too much. Okay, let's just finish this four just beside. And here is more dark spots. Okay, we'll return to this part a little bit later. Let's just blend a little bit this left side. Area. I wanna highlight this edge of his leg with going first. Thank you guys for staying and for watching. I appreciate your attention and help. It helps my channel to developing I could say to grow this stream definitely gonna take long time compared landscape painting It's okay. Okay, let's more burn timber and blend it. And also I will blend this his I think it's butt or how to call it the back side of his body. And here's also like black. And have to blend this whiter spot as well. I think I will use just a little bit white this area. And we have some shape already a little bit more white and drop it over here on his leg let's blend also what is under and I think I will add more brown on this area mm. 
But this is your second encounter, right? As I remember. Okay, let's just add some black over here to show more shadows. I think it's still far away from beautiful, but thank you, yeah. There is still a lot of work over here. And so I'm gonna divide this pole a little. Mm -hmm. It's kind of sitting over there. I just blend it a little bit to make it smoother. Hmm. Anyway, here here's gonna be grass and all that stuff, so I will not focus too much on details here because it's gonna be covered anyway. So let's we'll jump into our face. looks like A bit shadow. Hi Connor, thank you for joining. Super piece of music. What do you mean? Do you hear music playing? Because it's actually my neighbors listening music, and I just wonder if you can hear it. Because definitely I can hear it. But I don't think you can hear it so well as me. Actually, I just hope that YouTube didn't put it as copywriting. Because it's not my idea to use this music. light spot also. I think actually I can use kind of more white, especially on this area, because it's definitely more highlighted as we can see. So let's just drop a little bit more on this area. And a little bit on the top as well. Okay. And also a little bit under his nose, because here gonna be this black line. So I just wanna put some lighter and darker colors over here. I think I can use even more darker. And I can use a little bit of black. 
just a little bit because it can spoil your painting easily. Black is very strong compared to other tones, so you have to be careful with black. Okay, so let's just do a little bit more these darker spots, especially on the middle of his nose. And also under. Hi Creativo, thank you for joining We are painting a rabbit today. As you can see from the thumbnail. I'm okay, thank you for asking, feeling better right now and can handle this dream I believe. What about you? Not much interesting going on right now because actually this is only first layers I'm putting and here is still a lot of work especially with this four and those tones highlights I mean so yeah for now I'm trying to divide darker and lighter spot on his face you're fine that's great awesome Hi crop top, thank you for joining. Haven't seen you for a while actually. Ah, oh, because I didn't make streams. Yeah, that's that's okay then. <laughs> Hi Dan, thank you for joining as well. Ah, uh, bunny rabbit. Call it how you want. <laughs> so as I said before, I will repeat what I said because if you just joined. So I'm working on first layers right now. I'm just dividing this lighter and darker spots. And here's a little bit complicated because it's his face and I want to do it right. So I'm just mixing in finding these right tones using black and burnt amber but this black it's very strong so as I said have to be careful with this and let's just drop more shadows on his nose I want to show a little bit deepness but it's gonna be after like second or third layer I am not from Philippines, but I was living there and probably I'm gonna come back after all this pandemic situation will be over. I don't know yet. I'm staying in Europe right now at the moment. But anyway, I'm kinda, I could say I'm kinda living on both countries, but this pandemic kinda ruined plans and for now I'm in Europe. Hi Crafting, thank you for joining and for your comment. ABC Crayons, hi also. Yeah, so it's kinda like that right now. Situation is not that good. Cause I'm thinking to set up kinda a studio and I have issues. where to set up it here in Europe in my country or there in the Philippines so yeah it's a little bit difficult situation and I have to think as well yeah Europe is also fine you just need to make important decisions and like a big responsibility and also you know money spending and all that stuff thank you yet and Vanessa as well 
But anyway, if anything gonna be okay with my art and I can develop it here, it's not gonna be a problem to travel or stuff like this, you know. Okay, let's just drop some lighter color just beside our eye. Because I can see there is like white. No, it's not white, it's like light, light, very light brown. What I'm gonna put. And also on this right side a little bit. And let's just drop some brownish above uh, under our eye. As I can see there is some brown tone. And I think I can even blend it a little bit. Even you can blend with Bristol brush as well. Just use it like uh, kind of soft touches and it can help you to blend as well. Because anyway, it's kind of only first layers. Oh, I'm drawing. Yeah, that's true. This standard card fits a lot, that's true. So I'm kind of painting my thing, you know. But anyway, it's a little bit complicated. This rabbit. But I will not paint the carrot today. So if you are waiting, then sorry. No carrots today. Thank you, Caritiva. Yeah, I'm kinda trying, you know. To do some new stuff on the channel because at some point life is good because I don't need to edit after I just have to edit my thumbnail but not a video but also I'm not a very talkative person I'm just talking here what I'm doing the process And his head also is a little bit kind of triangle. What is it for triangle, really? Okay, let's add more white and mix it with Rosiena and drop it here on the left side. A little bit brownish. Okay, I just try to blend it a little bit with the same Bristol brush with the soft touches. But anyway, I have to be careful because it's easy to spoil. I think it should be a little bit like this actually. Kinda. Probably I covered too much on this area, so if I will just crop it a little. I think I can um, if I will add more kind of green I just try if our green gonna be like this I think it's gonna be a little bit better because you can see here and also in the reference photo it's a little bit up I think it's eyebrow and there is the eye already, but it's not visible. But it's definitely a little bit upper than eye. 
and also shape here is more more whiter and a little bit round so let's just let's just put it over here and add a little bit moustache after but still mm, I think it's okay just just fix this eyebrow on the side and put more colors over here and also a darker spot over this part hi Alex Danny thank you for joining as well haven't seen you for a while also how are you doing? And also this YouTube is crazy last, I think last months. I don't have, don't get notifications from many artists when I'm subbing. And I don't know why. Because it's really complicated to search anyone. It's kind of impossible to search anyone. And YouTube doesn't show notification and I don't know why even if you are subscribing, clicking the bell still something wrong with this, I don't know why Hi Mark thank you for joining us as well I'm just working with this first layer still this first layer and it takes some while actually but it's obvious here is a lot of different colors it looks like one but in fact here is a lot especially on his face and I don't want to spoil it so I'm just kind of doing it layer by layer Anyway, I will blend it after and sometimes you just can't understand or this is shadow or this is fur like this it also gives some compl complicated but it's also a little bit challenging for me sometimes to paint such animal painting especially because of his body and as you can see here is a lot of things it's not like just face and here is still body where you have to put this for thank you comics and Vanessa as well Hi aesthetic cards, thank you for joining also. Nice pin, yeah it's still a lot to do here. It's actually just first layers as I said many times already. But if you just joined you didn't hear me so I'm just telling you this now. And why I'm using this small brush? Because it's really convenient for me to do just small drops of paints aside just one big because I can control it pretty well so better I will just do it like this and it's gonna be at least understandable for me what I'm doing so let's just drop some darker spot under his nose as we can see so here and it's also going a little bit on the right side and I think it's more like grayish 
So, can okay, I just drop some white? Here we four, as we can see, it's white, so definitely I can drop it. And I will blend it after anyway. Here is like also what is this like round four over here? Let's drop more white. Make it lighter. Thank you, Dan Art as well. Something like this, and I want to blend it a little bit right now with my blender brush. So I'm using oil thinner, just a little bit oil thinner. It helps to blend. Hi, M. I am Arts. Okay, thank you for joining. Also, still a lot, what to do here. So let's just blend a little, also it can help me to cover this white spot, what I can't cover with a small brush and dry paint, so the oil thinner is going to help me with this, and at least I can see all tones. And his fur also going under. And let's plant more his nose over here. And this on this round parts. I think it's gonna be okay, at least I understand what to do next and I wanna cover this area. So let's just use this Rosiena and drop it here just to cover this white spot. And also on his nose Just a moment, guys. Okay. And I'm gonna drop some highlights again on this area. I think it's kind of kind of leap. I don't know how to actually call it. If you know how to call this side, this part of his face, let me know. But I think it's kind of leap. And there is a mustache. But we are not focusing on moustache right now, it's going to be the last what I will do. I just want to drop more highlights. Mm. 
Alright. And I can use more white above his eyes as well. For his eye. Here is only one eye. Also can blend it to make it smoother. Okay, we'll leave it like this right now and let's just drop to our ears. Because here is kind of pinky yellow tone we can see. Especially, especially inside our ear. And it looks like more gray. So, anyway, I have to mix this gray. I'm using black a little bit and white. And also, as I said before, this black is too strong and you don't need to put it too much, but I took too much already. And it's very grayish. So let's just add more lighter colors. I can use even raw sienna. Dude Creative Shift, thank you for joining and for your comment. Also Vanessa and Rasik, do you thank you for your comments and for watching. And then art as well. And others who are watching me. I definitely need more white. And yet still here, I appreciate it. So I just drop more white and and I think I'm gonna be mixing it with brown. Let's just try. And comics still here, that's great. So, okay, here it's kind of, can be gray on the top. It's more like gray. And it's also highlighted, but okay, this highlight I will do after. Let's just drop this grayish color. I will just put it with our, I think it's burnt umber, yeah it was burnt umber, to make it a little bit darker. Okay, let's just use black a little bit. Because here it's definitely more darker. together and a little bit gray and using it here on this dark spot and 
there and the top is more lighter and here on this side is just a little use white and it will be blended already during the process So it can be kind of like this, even more white on the top. This area. black black on the top just drop it and here more highlights on left ear just going down and I think here we also can use a little bit gray on his face while I still have this gray color on my brush I will just drop some spots Just blend it a little bit, maybe too much. So let's just use some brown. Kind of like this. Even more white on this area. And let's go back to our ear. And also have to blend it a little bit here, kind of. We have to show that our ears is part of our face. Of head, I mean. So then we have to kind of blend it here as well. So we just blend it. Let's continue to paint our ears. I think it's also kind of grayish on this part. Let's use white 
white and sienna and put some highlights over here anyway I will add more white when it's gonna be our kind of last details Inside our ear, okay, let's blend again to make it more softer. Inside the ear as well. Mm, I will use oil thinner again. Help me to blend. And this ear as well. And his ears are really different color from his body and his face. A little bit strange, why is it so? Okay. Well, nice look. Okay. Thank you for joining again. Okay, we'll use this um, umber, burnt umber, because I want to cover a little bit his gray ears. It's not so so it's not gonna be so grayish uh, just still first layers and I'm editing second just a little bit I want to cover this gray color a little bit because it's too gray and I'll drop more of this brown ok I think I will leave it like this for now at the moment then I wanna draw eye and this face over here and also wanna blend a little bit to make it more curve hmm. So we just use our small brush in black because here it's definitely black and it's kind of kind of small triangle. I 
so it's important to not spoil it. I'm going down. Kind of like this, and I will add more white on this area. Let's kind of highlight it again. And I want to show these highlights. And also on the left side. Well, so I will add this. It's kind of points on his nose and mustache after. put more sienna just beside this black line and white on the left side to highlight it a little bit Right. So let's paint our eye. Just need to zoom to see. Okay.
Okay, let, let it make more round, especially here. Right. And I need gray. It's definitely gray. Just around the eye. I just put a little bit gray on our eyeball on this area just above and I will blend it a little bit there now just to show it that it's kind of 3D Even more, can it on this left side and some white hole for the highlight? And I think it's a little bit darker over there. And like this, more black. And also, I would add some black spot on his face over here, and there's gonna be mustache after. So I have to put these spots I just put it randomly, I will not follow it like on the reference photo I think it's not necessary really I can simply put it I just use white I'm gonna put it on top of his face like this one to the white our lower part of his face mm, 
Here it's going to be more white, definitely. I'll just try to work a little bit with his fur. And I think I will use a simple brush as I used before, this Bristol brush. Let's see what it's gonna give us. some darker spot just beside the eye and also white especially on this area thank you Vanessa uh, but still there is a lot of details with this fur and I wanna Add it. I think it's take more time even than background, but nothing to do with this. I think I will change brush. Just try to experiment with different brushes. I have some kind of old Bristol brushes, it's kinda hard and here I mean it's hard and it's good for four. So I will just try to use some of it because I need to show this small details and it's a little bit hard to show with this. simple bristle brushes so if I will just use this one let's try Yeah, I think it's kind of works, but takes a lot of time. But we are not in a hurry. I am not in a hurry, so I want to draw this perfect four details. And actually, I'm using just white right now. It's gonna be. Okay, let me just try to drop it here as well. I think it's working. Just don't want to put a lot because it's easy to spoil. But little by little is okay. I just try to drop 
below his face A little bit lighter spot over here. Alright. Some dark. Still a little bit dark in this area. And actually I can drop some dark spots on his ears as well because it's also furry as we know so definitely can use it like this Drop some white on our highlighted area of ear. Can use even more white. Also on this side as well. Some part here. And let's continue to go on the top of our ear. Hi Ramli Arts, thank you for coming. I'm kind of working with some fur already. Not long time ago finished these first layers and can be focused on our fur. Fix some details over here because I don't like it a little bit. And I think I will add just a little bit black on this area. So some here is gonna be definitely darker. Hi oh, Yasanta, yes, thank you for your compliment and for coming. Ramli, it's rabbit or bunny or <laughs> call it how you want, just animal painting. So realistic then. Thank you, Vanessa. Yeah, I'm kind of trying to make it three dimensional, I could say, but I still want to add more details on his ears and just more details if. On four, and I want to show this darker spot on his ears, especially here, just be below, beside his head. And inside, 
like it's gonna be more shadow all over here and they're gonna be more light and also can use this Rosiana, so it's not gonna be so grayish and just drop it on this left ear and show some highlight as well especially below more lighter spot over there right and let's continue with our right here more white on his head especially this area and sienna Okay, let's add more to make it a little bit more furry and more fluffy than it is now. It's also okay if some of your fur coming out from the background, I mean coming on background. It's even can show some more interesting details of the rabbit. Just make it more darker beside eye. And a little bit grey again. This area. And some black I think beside uh, below this right ear over here just to divide it a little bit more from our head right okay now we'll go on our body and as I said before, I'm not gonna be focused too much on this area because here I simply will put grass. So what is left here is just to... Okay, well, we can cover actually this with green colors. Because here I will probably put grass a little bit like above his paws, legs. So we will not be focused too much. The 
just a moment. Alright. Mm -hmm. Okay, we just use same sienna like between this brown and light and simply drop it like four and then I will do this highlights it's mostly going until here on this area and going down so let's just use it and highlights I will do after just simply put it on top so it's not a big deal use one color right now Here gonna be a little bit lighter, so let's just use this lighter sienna on this area for I can't even say that this is highlight because as we talked before from the beginning that light is coming from the left side over here, so it's simply lighter for but still it has this lighter sienna I can drop it here on this area and white now I will use simple white Anyway, it's gonna be. It's it will mix on our painting already with another color, so it's okay to use it. And also, I wanna put it a little bit on our background to show that it's four and that it's going. Above I think it's gonna be okay. Some highlights over brown in the middle. and more on this right side of his leg and also there is his back and I have to cover it and then can use some dark spot color I mean and using white again it 
Okay, let's use the same white on the left side and it's actually gonna be already the highlight but definitely the light is here You can even put it below. And his butt I will use this light sienna color, what I did already. And also I will cover a little bit of background to show this floor. And also we'll add a little bit white for the highlight. Even more white. Sometimes I think that he took a lot of paint, but in, in fact there is no paint at all. Okay. And let's just use the sienna and put it here okay, brown burnt umber I mean I just call it brown because it looks like brown definitely Put it here in this darker spots over there, like there is no light coming, and definitely it's in shadow. Same with this leg, you can see. But as I said before, I will not be focused too much on this lower part because it's going to be covered with grass. So it's not going to make sense to focused on it, I just wanna drop some four on his leg over here and a little bit on the background and I will add white just for highlight Right. We well, definitely can see that our bunny is sitting on the grass. Okay, let's return to our floor in this area. Um, I will use this sienna a little bit lighter than this one. I mixed it before, as you remember. And I will just put it with the same technique to make it look like four. And this area is a little bit darker. This four looks like this actually. It's not about the light. have a lot of this 
burnt umber so I'm definitely gonna use it and I can put the sliders yeah no need so let's just show a little bit shadow on our left leg left from our side I mean and also I can drop it there on the shadow area as well some more highlighted moments here and also I wanna also I don't wanna divide this area too much as we can see it's really divided and so what I will do I will basically put this Rosiana on this side in the middle to make it kind of a little bit blended because I don't like that it's very divided and this burnt umber can put on this side just a little so it will not be very like two parts of different colors thank you yet I'm glad that you like it I still have to add grass over here to cover our legs and probably a little bit grass on the background but I will not focus on the background too much it's kind of blurred and it's fine with me the main object here is our bunny rabbit so we have to be focused on him and also I wanna kind of I don't like this line over here it's really and then too much highlighted we could say so so let's just add this sienna what left over and put it more in this area right now it looks much better than before before as you can see it's just like a simple spot of paints and actually this is the moment what i don't like in paintings because it looks a little bit weird and the people who is coming sometimes on the channel you know like maybe they're interested in arts but they are not so how to say they don't know so much of techniques and they can like say what is that and why it looks like dirty mess <laughs> but actually this is how they, these first layers for me it's like simply impossible to paint this right away with high detail and you know stuff like this thank you um, um, kind of add some four details over here I saw you were painting a portrait on Instagram I guess this is your commission painting right no oh, it's fine of course stream is too long to watch it all, it's understandable. Yeah, an Italian couple exactly. I am not a portrait artist definitely right now. Just animals.
Yeah, that's true. They are more, more cool to paint, actually. No, maybe portraits also is okay, because I tried it, but it didn't work, probably because it's it was kind of large canvas, and I need to start with small, because I'm mistaken with some colors and shades. And I just threw it away, the large canvas. So probably I will start with small. Probably half like this, it so would be fine. Okay, just just a minute, guys. Moment. No, it's gonna be just a rabbit, I think. But you can give a name if you want. But usually I don't give a name to animals. What I'm painting. Just a moment. I have to share this painting on my Facebook so people from Facebook also can join ok, I think it's alright we can continue so I will just cover some white spots over here I still have a lot of green actually not a lot but at least and plus blue color as well so I'm definitely I need more yellow Roger <laughs> Where that name came from, Roger. <laughs> it reminds me of some names from action American movies. There is some dude with name Roger, Jack and Roger. An action movie like back in the 90s, I think, yeah, that's movies. And there was that names. He doesn't look like Roger, you look at his face. He's ready for action if only if here is a carrot. Then yeah. Roger Rabbit. But maybe it's kinda cool to do a thumbnail with his name. Roger Rabbit. Yeah, just <laughs> your real American movie. It's kind of popular names over there. Back in the days, now I don't know, but maybe even now. So how did you find your customer? They just came from Instagram or they just some acquaintance of yours? Because usually some known people asking for something. If channel is not popular it's a little bit hard to find customers or without an advertisements.
the real life friends. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. At least they know you. Because, you know, sometimes new customers, it's hard to deal with. So much of explanations and all that stuff. I'm already getting tired just without starting to paint. But for the last months I don't have any customers. Because I sometimes I simply, simply don't want to have them. Discord is kinda Twitch or... I'm not familiar actually with Discord. I think kind of all commission painting is a little bit hard to paint because the way you see customer might see different but since he is paying your money you have to do all like they want Have you tried Patreon or Patreon? I don't really know how it's pronounced I think Patreon where all artists selling their stuff there like commission artworks and just regular lessons I could say Discord is like a huge place full of servers, games, art etc and you just drop your social and talk to people but sometimes someone asked to us artists, some commission, especially gamers. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is why you were doing some commissions on gamers, I saw. Yeah, but see, also, you're kind of doing drawing. I'm not sure that... But maybe some people will like oils as well. But I'm not sure. Yeah, that's okay. Thumbnails and logos. Yeah, it's more like drawing industry. I'm a little bit far away from the drawings right now. But I was doing drawings before, like letters. Now I just want to focus more on this. Some traditional, maybe, some traditional drawings on my own way, my own style. Okay, I'll just check it, how it looks like there. And now, there's so much different platforms and it's really hard to choose something. Cause when you're doing same post on each platform, it's also irritating. I think that my light is too strong here. What if I will put it like this? I just experiment. Now it's a little bit dark probably. I will just left it like this. some press behind mm. 
and here is already dark grass from the shadow so I'm not gonna paint highlights here actually I can use even this blue to make it more darker Happy green, happy rabbit on the green. I think I will add more highlights on rabbit, definitely. still have some leftovers and yeah anyway I have to edit some more details here stream another stream we're gonna see how much it gonna take comics like seven hours your stream is always long I remember First time I came to your stream it was like 6 hours. And I was just, oh my god, really, 6 hours. My first attempt was like 2 or 3 hours only, I think. And I was so tired. And also your painting is that small paper how you can able to paint that small for six hours <laughs> yeah hello hoop <laughs> he pretending just he's busy in fact uh, he's doing hello hoop I need to take chips at the same time. It's kind of the same, drinking soda or chips. Soda makes you fat also, same as chips. Maybe even worse, because there is a lot of sugars actually. Well, chip doesn't have so much, but it has oils. Actually this painting took me much faster than I thought it's gonna be. It's like almost 2 hours 30 minutes and I'm kinda done with main details. Ah, moustache, I forgot about moustache.
Ja, gallig op en zal de drinken. Okay, let's add more fur on the head, a little bit above the eye. Actually, Filipinos are a little bit obsessed with this soda drinking. I remember we were going on different occasions, like even Christmas like birthdays or any other and there is always soda they all the time drinking this soda it's crazy really this coke is everywhere these small cokes just everywhere Vanessa, you're still here actually. I have to go after to watch your video as well. Okay, let's add more white um, beside our eye. I'm gonna add also more highlights on this ear. So we can see it's going down. Okay, and thank you for being here and for your comments and for just for a fun time. So Roger, Rabbit Roger.
I am running out of white already. And I hope it's gonna be enough. I don't wanna put more white. But I do want to put a little bit more dark below, especially beside grass, because here is no light at all. Hey Manny, thank you for joining. We are painting a rabbit today. It's kinda almost done. Not at all, but almost. It's kinda was a requested painting, I think a long time ago. And I decided to paint it right now just as a live stream. And I'm putting some last details. But those last details might take long. So yeah. more details on this ear. So a little bit here. Also I'm gonna put some dark spots on this ear because it's kind of wrapped. It looks like it's wrapped a little. So we just want to divide it a little bit. Okay, let's just try to put some moustache. I'll try to use a synthetic brush. It's kind of liner, but it's not so long as liner. But it would be good if it was longer, but I don't have it. So I will try to use this to make some moustache of the rabbit. And if it will not work, I will use palette knife. It might be a little bit difficult.
it's kind of working. Maybe it's too thick at some moment, but still. It's understandable that this is moustache. Just need more white. Alright. Also, I can try to use this for some more highlights. Uh, but anyway, I need white. I didn't want to put it, but I had to. Because it's simply not enough. Okay, let's just try to use this white for some highlights and additional fur. And I need oil thinner, it's also almost done. Hi Dr. Artist, thank you for joining us today. We're painting a rabbit and I'm just putting last details on his fur. Thank you, I'm glad that you like it. Thank you Vanessa as well for always watching my artworks. And also on ears again if returning to ears I wanna drop some highlights on the top and from the side. I'm using white and still this white is mixing with our paints what is here already. So it's not necessary to mix all here. Not so much people here at the moment, Dr. Artist, like one hour ago was more. I think all good, all doing good, same as you.
Where are you from, by the way? Are you from India or...? Because many Indian people here are actually joining sometimes. Yeah, definitely this is a live stream, because I'm replying you. Oh, one kid, you're here again. Hi. Yeah, yeah, this is a live stream. Definitely a live stream. And some lines on his face as well. I think I have to buy liner brush. But it's hard to find also, because I have liner brush, but this liner brush is soft, it's synthetic, it's not what I need, I need a Bristol brush. Oh, okay. Why sketch a mess? Just draw some lights, highlights here on the back, just a little bit. And let's just drop it here as well. So, also some highlights on top of his head. Okay. I'll just add more on some other areas as well. I need a little thinner again. Okay.
and some white above the eye as well. Yeah, fluffy, fluffy bunny, fluffy rabbit. I don't know what the big difference, I think it's... No, rabbit is large, right? But bunny is small, as I remember. But their face look the same, actually. Kind of similar. It's a small details, never ending story really. Can put it over and over again. Giving you a full watch by the comics, he, she is a girl. She is not a body. I think the word body using for men only. It's not same as guys when you can use it for both, as I know. Okay, I think it's kind of close to finish, if you can see any details what I can change maybe or kind of fix, let me know, because I don't see it anymore right now. Okay, just a moment. A teenager. Okay, a little bit white. A little bit more white above the eye. Maybe you don't see too much changes, but I see it here. And so 
recommendation light for here. And you just highlight moustache a little bit. I will just add some small moustache. Seems like you're having a great time, artist, there by making foods and drinks. That's cool. Okay. I think I will leave it like this right now because shadows are shown. And not too much, but to show more. Maybe just some highlight on another eye. Wait, what if I just add a little bit? I'll put it a little bit up over here. No, this is the uh, oils. I'm using only oils here right now on this channel. Yeah, that is important. <laughs> That's true. Hi Sketch, I saw you already. Maybe you just didn't hear, but it's okay. Okay, I think it looks pretty nice. And shadows is showing well as, as well. I will just put away my paints. A moment.
I was talking from the beginning actually, but I'm a little bit tired of talking so much. So yeah, I'll just take off the scotch tape and I will put my sign first. So it's gonna be in the same side as always. Thank you guys, if you like this painting, don't forget to press like, share it to your friends and all that stuff. I will really appreciate your help. So let's just take all this scotch tape. I think next painting gonna be landscape. Sketchy. I say it hi to you already many times. Yeah, it actually would be nice if someone can pet him. And so I will consider this painting as a commission. Yeah, definitely. This is just a photo. So, kind of like this. Just a moment. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do live stream on Wednesday probably I just want to do landscape so yeah maybe if you could see even better I will turn it like this a little bit If you have ideas what to paint guys let me know also maybe you wanna see some other animal or some other landscape or some flowers as well because this is like three main theme topics what I'm painting right now probably I will do also more flowers on the channel I just don't wanna focus too much only on animals or on your landscape it's better to mix for example now we paint rabbit next painting we will paint landscape and another stream gonna be flowers and go on a dragon i don't know if i can paint a dragon really because it's kind of complicated probably 
I can try to paint a face because I don't use large size and Dragon has a lot of many details and you kind of I can probably put it like here but it's gonna be small I would for myself I would like more to paint like face of the dragon or try to paint face of the dragon or something like this probably if I can find good reference photo Babita Misha, thank you for your comment as well. Okay, artists, thank you for being here, and all of you guys also, thank you for being here. And I will see you on the next live stream or on someone's another video on the channel as well. Anime characters, I don't paint here anime, char anime characters, mostly animals, landscapes and flowers right now. So yeah, consider those topics. Okay, thank you all and I will see you again some other day or another time. Appreciate your help. Take care all. Bye bye.